Good Saturday morning, everybody. It's me, Trevor Thompson, the self-appointed Looney Tunes critic, and I'm here with my good buddy, Sean McBee. It's always a good Saturday with when you start it with bugs. Exactly. I mean, it's this is how we grew up, and we knew it worked out well, so we, we ripped off a formula that has been lying dead. This is Hair Trigger, a Frizz Freeling cartoon, a Merry Melody from 1945. And um, background and layout, Paul Julian and Holly Pratt. Paul Julian is the back. I don't know why they chose to word it that way. Background and layout. And then they said the, the background guy's name and then the layout guy's name. That's yeah, weird. That's weird. But Paul Julian is the, is the roadrunner, by the way, everybody. Mm-hmm. Yep. And uh, I remember for years, this shot of the, uh, the engine jerking around. Not this bread and butter, bread and butter. But this shot of the, uh, the engine jerking around always reminded this one. This always reminded me of, of Dumbo, that opening scene in Dumbo. I don't know. Nothing on that? Okay. No, I got nothing. <laughs> well, you picked this uh, this cartoon, so... You're the Looney Tunes critic. That's a Disney cartoon. I know, but I can like other cartoons. No. Go get the axe! There's a flea on Lizzie's ear. So tell us why uh, you picked this cartoon, Mr. McBee. You know, honestly, I picked this cartoon because of one gag in it that I love <laughs> very, very much. All right. Well, then we'll we'll bring that out. But here's a... Uh, also, I wanted to get some frizz in there. Yeah. Yeah. You haven't... Uh, I don't think you've had any commentaries that you did with frizz, right? I don't think so. Not yet. Hmm. Well, you know what? If, if there is no. one that we haven't realized... That- I got another one in my head that we can do later. Oh, yeah? Okay. Uh, this is the first official Yosemite Sam cartoon where it's it's actually Yosemite Sam. Yeah, you um, can really make out his mask. Yeah, there's He's got that thing on his nose. There's act yeah, there's earlier incarnations of him, but uh this is where he's given a name. And actually, this was one of the, you know, this is in the early days when he wasn't bald. For some reason he became bald over the years and I never understood it. It's weird to have a beard and those big eyebrows and a robber's mask and no hair. Not that this isn't weird. I love that he was clearly designed to be a a cowboy bandit guy. Yeah. But no matter what circumstances they put him in, his look was pretty much the same. Yeah. (laughs) He he didn't do too many cowboy western pictures. Yeah. But he always had the the cowboy hat and the, the bandit mask. And he always had those guns, too. We didn't always have the hat. Nighty Night Bugs, he wore yeah, yeah, a that's suit right. of armor. That's right. That's true. But he had that mustache. That very Western mustache. Yep. Mm-hmm. And uh, Mel Blanc was a character... Or Yosemite Sam was a character that Mel Blanc couldn't do uh, until it was the end of the week. They had to do all of his lines at the end of the week. and Because um, it was, it was it, so... It is throat... Yeah, roughening, and it was really bad at the end of his life. Like he, for the most part, the last twenty years of his life, if you hear if you hear Yosemite Sam voiced by Mel, it's usually one or two sentences. I like that really uh, cinematic shot. Yeah, well, be ya. And they're probably again. This is what's so great about these cartoons. They're probably referencing some movie that was out then. Well, westerns in general, westerns were, in general. were so, like so saturating the public perception. I think that it didn't need to reference anything specific. <laughs> I'm giving you tells him to draw a gun. I as a as a kid, even as a kid, I just knowing that I you know how to draw a little bit it pissed me off that they never had a, a any animation of him taking the page that bugs had just drawn on and flipping it over so he's drawing on top of bugs's <laughs> drawing and it's always bothered me he just keeps erasing that's why and I used to say tell myself that's why bugs really hates it And I also... That's a bit of an overreaction, don't you think? Yeah. It stinks. <laughs> it stinks. And, well, you know what? Artists understand. We want people to be objective. We say that, but we really want everyone to just love it. And then... <laughs> I wish I knew what movie this was. What that's from. Um, there was a but, few... Uh, again, there were so many to choose from. Yeah. And wasn't there a few other cartoons too where it was Bugs and and Sam on a train? (laughs) (laughs) Now here they go and they wait. (laughs) 
Cartoons are the I best. Lo I love the foot tapping. Yeah. Oh yeah, this is the this is the gag that you that you love so much right here. Yep. You know me so well. <laughs> and I think what you like most about it is 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 the, the U-turn of emotions. Yes. That, that is exactly it. <laughs> okay. So you know there the ink is going to play into it because it's the one thing in the background that doesn't have shading on it. Yeah. <laughs> Also, it says ink in big letters. Yeah, <laughs> it's like look over here, everybody. All right, let's uh, let's hear the the gag that Sean loves so much. The vomit got me. And I really love the animation too when when he when he croaks here. I Twitches. Yeah. <laughs> the the twitch the twitch uh, when they go in close up here is also really really good. Um, I wish I knew who animated it. I'm not from, as familiar with Frizz's unit. <laughs> Here it is. <laughs> I love that. <laughs> oh, that's so brilliant. All right, and here comes your favorite line. Why did you pour ink on my head? <laughs> <laughs> he I love this calm, reasonable <laughs> questioning. Like, like, really, dude? And McKimson Why? stole that joke later in a Tasmanian Devil cartoon. Oh, really? Which one? Uh, I don't remember which cartoon, but uh, mm. he, you know how Taz spins around. I know that. Makes yeah. him makes him uh, drill into the ground, and then he like oh, gives yeah. him a funeral, and then he Why comes up for? and he goes, and, he, and then he comes up and he's all mad and he goes, "Why did you bury me in the cold, cold ground?" I believe that's Devil May Hair. It Devil may well be. You know what? We should do that cartoon. We shall. All right, Sean, let's shake on it. <laughs> <laughs> we didn't rehearse that. We're hacks. Um, <laughs> did you knock something over? Oh, your, did your wallet fall out? I squeezed my wallet out of my pants pocket. <laughs> wow. That's, that's how much I commit to this commentary. Dash to bits, man. See, just like the old uh, uh, cliffhanger films yeah yeah all right i like that that was subtle but i appreciate it all right folks we will be back next week that's all folks <laughs> <laughs>